Hi guys, so I recently did a lot of shopping recently and these are my recent pickups for the last, I want to say like two months or so. Um, yeah, I have a huge pile of clothes right here. Um, I'm just going to pull from it and talk about it. So my first one is this Hood by Air crop top. So I went to the Museum of Sex with my friend Luigi and they, in the back of the store, or in their store, they have like a flea market. It it was really, it was really weird because it was in the Museum of Sex and it, they just had like booths of like people selling random things like clothes or jewelry or just miscellaneous other things and there was this guy who was selling like a bunch of like okay his booth of clothes were like in my opinion like the best like section because I mean this is where I picked this up I got this hood by air um white crop top I really like it but it's like a bummer because I haven't even worn it yet and New York's weather has dropped immensely because now it's like in its 60s so I can't exactly wear a crop top I mean I can but I'm definitely most wearing like a jacket over it but it's like okay the sides are the major details of it so if I wore like a jacket or something to cover it you'll only see like the white so it's like you don't see the detail of everything so I'm kind of hoping it gets in the 70s so I can like wear it without a jacket and then like pop on a jacket later okay so I kind of went crazy on buying a lot of trousers I bought one two three four four pairs of pants and they're all okay so three of them or I guess two of them three of them are like in the same hue like brownish in the brown stone beige color so I got these and they're more like puddle pants on me I really like the grid pattern and the color I don't really wear a lot of brown or beige or anything like that so I want to like get into that more for fall and winter because I mean if you follow my Instagram I wear a lot of color and so I don't want to like stop wearing color but I definitely want to like branch out into more like neutral colors these were from Goodwill then my next pair of pants are I think these are puddle pants as well and they have a houndstooth print on them and I'm not sure if the camera picks up but there's like subtle hints of blue mixed with the brown and black within the houndstooth and these were from Goodwill as well and then this one my next pants are actually navy pinstripe pants and they're cropped actually and these were from Goodwill and my last pair of pants are these sick suede brown pants they're actually cargoes like look how cool these are and it's like patched almost so like the top the bottom and then the bottom bottom it's different the zipper and then they have like a drawstring at the bottom of the pants it's so really sick they're from INC I don't know if you guys heard of this brand but that's the brand um yeah these are from Goodwill um the Goodwill in Brooklyn I like that one a lot than the Goodwills in Manhattan because you tend to find more of gems there. My next item is actually an item that I got at Beacon's Closet. So the day before I went to Beacon's Closet, the one in Brooklyn Greenpoint, I saw this girl wearing a red jumpsuit and I was like, oh, that's so cute. I wonder where she got it from. Well, on her tag is a dicky. So I was like, oh, she's wearing a dicky jumpsuit. Maybe I should like look into that. But I didn't think anything of it. So the next day, went to Beacon's Closet and guess what? Dun, dun, dun. I found the same jumpsuit for 15 bucks. What's up? Because I looked online and I think they're like 45 if I remember. But I was like, holy cow, I found the jumpsuit for only 15 bucks. But the thing is, I guess the previous owner took off the Dickies tag off the front pocket. Not a big deal. But I mean, they left the back pocket label. I don't understand. But. Regardless, I found it for super cheap and 
it's red I love wearing red I don't know why I love wearing red so much but it's like my favorite color to wear so I was like heck yeah something red so continuing my red stream of clothes I got this utility vest I love it it's not black even though I was debating on getting the black one and the red one but I was like I'm just 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 too many vests but then when I get ready I'm like I need a black vest because it'll just oomph this outfit more and then I'm like oh I should have bought a black vest and then like I go to look for a black vest and I'm like I don't need a black vest I, I ended up wearing a black vest literally like two nights ago. But anyway, I initially wanted this red one because, well, I love the color red. I don't know. It's just my favorite color to wear. And I am utterly obsessed with it because most people have like black or the tan looking one. I was like, red, that's pretty sick. So I got it. I really like the mini pockets. It's actually a fisherman vest. It's pretty cool. It actually looks cool with this Lacoste sweater that I'm wearing. But yeah, I feel like it'll be a good addition to my fall wardrobe. So my next piece that I got is a hoodie because fall is here and it's basically hoodie season. So I ended up looking for a black hoodie because I have a okay, I have a black hoodie, but it's Justin Bieber and you're like, oh my gosh, that's Justin Bieber hoodie. Yes, I do. And I got it from H&M, okay? And it's very comfortable, but I'm like literally so over it. So I was like, okay, I need another like regular basic black hoodie, but like not a basic black hoodie, but a black hoodie. And so I got this Helmet Lang hoodie. I like it because it just says helmet and then in the corner this. I think it's called the index hoodie and I know they have a white one but I obviously ended up getting the black one. And then on the back shoulder it says uncommon action in a society of repressed thoughts. And then on the hood it says helmet. So I really love the little details on it. And the strings have the silver aglet on it. I think it's a nice, simple black hoodie to wear. I mean, I've been wearing it a lot just because it goes with literally everything. I think I could even wear it underneath this vest if I wanted to. And I picked up three different bags. My goodness, I love a good purse situation just because, I mean, purse. Definitely need it to put in my lip gloss, that's my only concern. I need a good purse for my lip gloss. But I got this Prada Sport side bag because it's really tiny and the compartments are pretty nice because like here and then, I mean, I guess you could put your pencils in here if you wanna put your pencils in here, if you wanna take notes or whatever and like little pockets and then it has a side pocket and then on here and then like a back pocket on the back side so yeah simple and I like the fact that it has a little touch of red so when I wear like red pieces I can wear this bag to tie it in and it's it won't be as loud as what I'm already wearing so yeah that's my first bag and then I've been wearing this one a lot my cold wall bag it's from one of the older seasons because the newer seasons like has more compartments and like there's a red one it's like five hundred dollars but they have a red one that has like i think like two compartments or something like that insanely sick totally want that but i don't think i'm gonna get it i feel like almost everyone has it but that's fine because i like it most people have the the canvas beige looking one but I went with black because I wear more black than beige and then my last piece is this vintage Gucci bag um fairly simple monogram some people don't like monogram but I think this one's nice especially with the detail of the braid and it's basically just like a bucket of like stuff you just see lip gloss <laughs> as long as I have my- there's literally just lip gloss and chapstick or lip balm. I hate having chapped lips. But that's basically all I ever carry. If you ever wondered what I carry in my purses, 
I'm pretty happy with the most recent things I picked up just mostly because I feel like my fall slash winter wardrobe has been like the same for the past two years or so or at least I think it's like the same so it feels good to like refresh a little for my colder season wardrobe but yeah let me know your thoughts on the stuff that I picked up favorite items i don't know if you guys like this video please give it a thumbs up if you haven't subscribed please do and i'll see you guys next time